Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and joining me here on the commentary box is Lee Dixon. And we have the first match in the Conmebol Libertadores group stage coming right up for you. It's Rosario Central and they take on Deportivo Táchira. Well, thank you, Derek. Well, you look at the host being such big favourites in this game. Just wonder how their opponents approach the game. I think the key to this is keep it really tight in the first 20 minutes. Try and frustrate those home fans. And then hopefully you can nick a goal here and there and take your opportunities. This is how it looks for the home side. The emphasis perhaps on keeping things tight at the back, Lee. Yeah, I really like this system. Very fluid look about it. It can be five at the back when you haven't got the ball, but those wing backs can push into midfield to make a 3-4-3 formation. The width supplied by the wingers to a lone striker. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. It looks pretty orthodox, Lee. Yeah, I love this formation, 4-4-2. The two main strikers will stay close together. The full-backs will link up with the wide players. The two holding midfielders will sit in front of the centre-backs. Very solid look about this team. Well, it's terrific to have the Copa Libertadores group stage finally underway. The biggest club competition here in South America with a rich history going back to the 60s. Lee, always a pleasure to be here commentating with you. But most importantly, who do you fancy to go all the way? Well, probably one of the sides from Argentina or Brazil, to be honest. They've been so dominant over the last few decades and it's hard to see past one of those powerhouses. Hopefully, we're proven wrong and there's maybe a few upsets along the way, Derek. Torrent. Well, showing good vision. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Granados. Flores with it. Marco Ruben. It's with Sabala. No potential danger. It looks promising. Gamba. Fruitful looking attack. Oh, surely! Wide of the target, and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed? Wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. Chacon. Gomez. Just cutting off the supply. Lasso. Torrent. Joaquin Lasso. Lasso. Torrent. Well, many have remarked upon the hosts and their preferred style, which is one of high pressing and trying to get the ball back quickly. Lee, do you expect to see more of that in this game? Yes, Derek, high pressing is their game, but there is a risk attached to it. If the opposition break through that press early on, you can be left vulnerable at the back. Might really be able to trouble them here. Well, can they make one of these passes count? 
far from a good pass. Granados. Flores with it. Oh, nice ball. And the decision is one of offside here. Sabala. Options in the middle. Torrent. Marco Ruben. Masterful piece of foiling. And he read it well. Ruben. Emiliano Vecchio. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. Marco Ruben. Ruben. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Looks promising this. And he read it well. Covea. Gomez on the ball. Attending to his defensive chores. A chance to nudge in front. Corner kick here. And firing it into the area. Oh, that's an awful finish. And the goalkeeper could do nothing but hang on to it. Easy save for the keeper. Absolutely terrible finishing from the attacker. Clattered away. Vecchio. Now Lucas Gamba. Emiliano Vecchio. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. The hosts have had the lion's share of possession, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very... Might go ahead! And the cross is very much on. Chance here! And they bought themselves a bit of time. And you need your defender to take charge. Fernando Torrent. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Precise ball movement. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Can they convert? And there it is, the opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And then through on goal, he never really had any doubt he was going to slot that away. Good finish.
1 0 then. Flores. Moving forward effectively. Gomez. Showing a real will to win the ball. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Delightful pass. And after the cross, defensive action called for. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire and a steely determination. Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Chacon. Hernandez. Gomez. And he'll take efforts like that all day long. Fernando Torrent. Ruben. Emiliano Vecchio. Patient build up at the moment. Fruitful looking attack. And that'll be offside. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Hernandez. Gomez. Gamba. That's a lovely ball. Crossing opportunity. Well cleared away. Hernandez. And a bad touch like that usually will mean giving the ball away. And possession given away. And a throw in it's going to be. Well, they've decided to make a change. Chacon. Gomez. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. Ruben. Gamba. Emiliano Vecchio. Now, what can they do from here? Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Vecchio. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Looks promising, this. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Vecchio. An attack full of promise. It looks promising. We'll Getting in there to intercept. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity.
Chacon. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Delivering it into the box. Able to get his body in the way. Player in the way again. Gamba. Shot attempted. Straightforward take. I don't think too many players would have the overdrive to get to that one. Goalkeeper's ball. Flores. And a good looking pass. Flores. A chance to whip it in. Covea. This looks promising. Crucial interception amid impending danger. Now can they counter clinically? Sabala. Vecchio. He continues his run. Emiliano Vecchio. And they could do damage. A fine block. Chacon. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Rinaldo. Well, by playing keep ball like this, they're keeping the opposition at bay. Not showing good patience. Lost possession. Hernandez. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Breaking at pace. And space to cross it. Terrific block there. Just the clearance that was needed. Torrent. Rinaldo. Marco Ruben. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. Could play it in. Fruitful looking attack. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Corvea. An effective ball. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. Teammates in the middle. Now the pressure from his opponent was telling. Substitution time as is here. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Gamba. Rinaldo. 
Well, let's see if something comes of this. This could finish it. A oh, tremendous block. And that is full time. Really, the worst possible start, you've got to say. That's the last thing you need. Start of the qualifying stages. You don't need a zero point, Sally. You almost need memory loss now to forget about that. Down to five games to qualify. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance this evening, Lee. He's always a man to watch for the opposition, but they couldn't keep tabs on him in that vital moment when he grabbed that goal.